hi guys this is data slash fun youtube channel today we are going to see arc terrace for beginner lesson 5 in that lesson we will see how to import data files in r basically we more of times use excel and csv file for analysis but uh, we will see text file excel file and csv file how to import this type of file in r studio so let's see so this is my r studio and first we need to set a working directory what is a working directory uh, this is the folder on my d drive d drive data files so on that d drive i have saved some files like sample movies data dot csv sample movies data dot xls sample text txt files so basically we step by step see how to read uh, how to read this type of text file csv file and xlx files in your r studio first i'm going to just copy this address of that file so this is my address of file here i just copied it and you can see here i'm going to just paste it in here <clears throat> so by default it is single backward slash you can give double backward slash or single forward slash for setting a working directory by this command set wd and give this working directory which where we already save some files and which we want to read these files from that location so my working directory is set here set wd and from this working directory i can read any file then first we see how to read text file so what is my text file so this is my simple text file but you can see here the first two rows are not useful for any analysis first is the description of that data the mark list and after the third line the actual data is started because second line also blank and after the third line this data is started so how to read this type of file so i just write here when data frame name data is equal to read dot table for reading text file and write a whole name of that text file with the extension so this is my file name of text file sample underscore text file dot txt and the file name should be in double code then header why we use header for you can see here the in text file there is a column names okay there are some column names like number name mark so by header the r can understand the we need to first row of that file is column names okay then skip equal to 2 why because first two lines are not useful so i just write here skip equal to 2 so let's see how it is showing my data so there is one warning but ignore it it's not serious warning yeah you can see here the first two line are skipped by skip function by header function there are some column names and the data is in our required format okay very simple for importing text file any text file you can read this type of uh, text file in using this type of command read dot table then next is xlx file so i'm just going to show my xlx file this is my sample underscore movies underscore data xlx file and on that file you can see this sheet one is blank sheet two is also blank but on sheet three there are there are some values some data so here also first two lines are not useful so we need to skip these lines also for, for while reading the xls file after third line there is a, there are some column names started and the data so let's see how to read xls file which having data on sheet 3 so i just write here command library xls for reading xls file you need to install this package in your r studio guys uh, keep in mind like uh, you need to install the package only once after installing you just need to recall that package if you want to use the package so just install once and record this package by library function I just recall this package by library function I write here one data frame name you can give any name I am just giving here my data one read dot xls in bracket sample underscore movies underscore data 
dot xls the extension which is in double code okay then sheet index why sheet in index because we want to read data from sheet number three header equal to true we want the column name so header equal to three start over three why three because from row third actual data is started the two rows is uh, two rows are not useful for our analysis so start row is third so let's see and i just write here one command for viewing data view head my data frame name my data one and five rows so by this command we can see the five rows of data frame yeah you can see the first two lines are skipped the data is started from this line so rank title these are the column names by head equal to true function and the data is in this format okay then excel is done next is form csv comma delimited file so this is my comma delimited file csv so here also same data but first two lines are not useful first two rows sorry are not useful after the third row there are data is started so let's see how to read this type of file csv file for reading the csv file we not need to install any package read.csv function is by default in our r studio i just giving the data frame name my data underscore 2 is equal to read.csv and the csv file name sample underscore movies underscore data skip two lines because the two lines are not useful header equal to true in excel while excel reading there is a start row for skipping the lines and in csv for reading csv file there is a skip from that skip you can skip any lines if you want to skip okay and just view this data by this command view head of that my data frame 2 and 5 rows yeah you can see the actual data format which we want to read is here rank title category director actor year and all the column names are here so hope you guys understood about so how to read csv file xls file and text file in your r studio please try this code on your r studio and please subscribe this youtube channel and press our like button and share with your friends thank you so much for watching